Okay, got another test set up here. There's a resonator capacitor and two microwave transformers. They're sitting here in the sun. Uh, capacitor set up to a power pole structure. And uh, capacitors, four capacitors, two series, two parallel. Gives me one microfarad more or less. And uh, yeah, top line M meter, and I'll go to the other side. Here we have the HVM meter. There's another close up on the caps. No microwave transformers, that's the mains incoming meter. And then in the ground, I've got a uh, KV meter that is basically 110 volt meter. So where uh, the 10 is, is 100 volts, 15 is 150 volt step potential. Uh, two electrodes I've got here in the sole, five, six centimeters apart. Got the box grounded on one end, three sitting in here. And just touching the top line which sits on the resonator. After that experiment I will be showing a pink arc if it shows out. This uh, TV wire aluminium gives me blue arc and then copper gives me green arc. Looks really cool. So uh, we'll try that out. Okay, plug the device in. Release electrons. The mains incoming current is about 3 ampere. HV is about uh, or 0 0.2, 0 0.3 of an amp. I'm not sure if the camera picks it up, but uh, got pilot LEDs there on the 3 volt winding of the MOTs. So here yeah, we get a little bit more smoke developing. Okay, camera roll now. Cut about a minute and a half out. We can see the tracking form. Incoming current 5 ampere. I'm gonna put the cooling fan on and the MOTs. This is about uh, 4.2 kV with capacitor boost.
That potential meter is up to 100 volts at 5 centimeters. The whole tree on fire now. Linear burn, the mains current is 20 ampere. MOT is still happy. Hopefully, and that current is only about two ampere. No, not even now one ampere. I need to check the MOT. So this quickly the end of the ice. Hanging in there, I'll energize again. The potential is 150 volts. 